What's good Deluxe family, welcome back to the channel. So in this video right here, we're about to be watching how Beyonce gets possessed by another external spirit that she likes to call Sasha Fierce. Now she said this multiple times in multiple different interviews. So it's coming to the point where the people that are really still true Beyonce fans, y'all not even worshipping Beyonce, y'all worshipping her alter ego, that demon that's possessing her name, Sasha Fierce. That's who y'all really enjoy at this point in time, because she literally said, every single time I go up on stage, a whole entire another entity comes into me and takes over. It's no longer even me. I just want to show you guys this picture right here, because it shows a lot. It shows which side that Jay-Z and Beyonce are really picking. They're not praying to Father God. They're not praying. They don't, they don't believe in Jesus. They know Jesus is real, but they're scared of him, bro. They really messing with witches out here. This is a very well-known witch. This is Jay-Z right here. Here goes another photo. <laughs> Cause at this point in time, bro, like why are they doing all of this, bro? For the money and fame, bro. Look at what he's doing. I don't know what type of demonic ritual is going on right here. But you have to keep in mind. This is Beyonce's husband. Beyonce ain't too far fetched from whatever they doing right there, but you guys about to see. So I wanna show you guys how Beyonce clearly states that an entirely another being takes over and then everything changes from there, all right? She says it in two different interviews and we're gonna watch both of them. When you're getting ready to go on stage and perform, does Sasha Fierce, when does she show up? Usually when I hear the crowd, like the, the moment right before when you're nervous and, and that other thing kind of takes over for you, then Sasha Fierce appears and my posture and, and the way I speak and everything is different. She, she's saying that other thing so she don't scare people, but she really mean that other spirit. That takes over. And then we have her saying that the same exact thing again right here, man. It was way better than, than I expected. And Sasha was in full effect. Sasha is my alter ego. And when people see me, sometimes I think that when they meet me and they speak with me, they're expecting Sasha. And, um, I seen that dance move though. <laughs> what kind of dance move is this one right here? That's, that's the Sasha dance move, bro. And, um, I'm really kind of shy, and not really shy, but more reserved, and, um, nothing like Sasha. <laughs> I guess I wouldn't be very entertaining on stage. So Sasha comes out <laughs> and she's fearless. You know, she can she can do things that I cannot do when I'm in rehearsal. I mean, I can try, but then it just doesn't happen. Sa Sasha probably actually scared of Jesus, though. Sasha probably scared of the Holy Spirit. If I walk up to Sasha and be like, Jesus, Sasha finna run. What are you talking about? And sing notes and sing strong and do all these things that when I'm just by myself, I can't do. And I remember right before I performed, I raised my hands up and it was kind of the first time I, I felt something else come into me. And I knew that was gonna be my coming out night. Oh, come on now. It don't get more clear than that. Beehive. I don't know, what do they call, what do they call the Beyonce freaking I can't recall y'all fans at this point. Y'all like so much deeper than fans. Y'all some worshipers, bro. <laughs> because at this point, it's being said to you straight up. A whole nut. She said, I felt something. What did she say again? I don't want to mess up her words. <laughs> she lifted her hands up. Um, I, I felt something else come into me. And I knew that was going to be my coming out night. So she lifted her hands up. And she felt something else coming into her. The same exact way. So if you go to church and you praise in the Lord, you lift your hands up, you pray, Holy Spirit, boom, boom, boom. You want the Holy Spirit to come into you. You feel what I'm saying? To make you more pure. So you can see the world more clear. She over here lifting her hands up so Sasha Fierce could come into her and so she could be doing some different things. Because she clearly explained that, that normally... She doesn't do all that promiscuous, all that sexual stuff. She's actually shy normally. But when, when Sasha Fierce starts to come in now, that's when she becomes more lustful, more promiscuous, starts showing off her body, twerking. 
throwing it back all up on stage because that's a whole entire another entity taking over. What are they, the queen, queen beehive or whatever, like, like how do y'all really feel about that? You know what I'm saying? Like, just thinking about it and, and, and hearing what she's saying, what do you, how y'all feeling about that right there? Just from a logical standpoint, because she's saying it very clear. For the BT Awards. <laughs> saying now now don't don't get me wrong yeah <laughs> don't get me wrong Beyonce look good you feel what I'm saying that doesn't change the fact that her her external appearance is pretty but don't let that be an illusion to what's really going on don't let don't fall for her beauty and get trapped by her wickedness come on now why would we do that we gotta walk smart we have to yeah so there's just so much being brought up right here. Now let's get to this video right here now. In this video, I'm not gonna lie, I already watched it. <laughs> I already watched it. And when I watched it, it kind of made it made me chuckle. Because <laughs> because Sasha Fierce done scared Jay-Z. <laughs> Sasha Fierce scared, scared Jay-Z in this video right here while they were performing. Jay-Z was type shook. I'm not gonna hold you guys. So it says, the title of this video right here is Jay-Z gets surprised at Beyonce. You should see it. Because Beyonce, because it seemed like Sasha Fierce taking over now. You guys got to keep in mind, these are videos from way back. Right now, Beyonce is still doing a, uh, the same thing, but just on a whole different level, yeah. Like, she, she was working up in them ranks, bro. What was that going on, y'all? Yeah? After this went down, watch how she starts tweaking after. Watch how her whole entire demeanor changes. got this whole entire different energy going. Saying that Beyonce is not a good singer, you know what I'm saying? And that's the reason why she came to this point. But her desire for the fame and the money is what led her to get to the point where it's like, all right, I understand when I get up on this stage, I want to be the best performer. I want to have things go crazy. So I'm going to have, I'm going to let this other thing take over me so I can start doing the things that I usually normally wouldn't do. Like, I, I normally wouldn't get up on stage or, like, a Super Bowl halftime with all my cheeks out and start shaking that joint singing. Like, I usually, she wouldn't usually do that, but now she needs some external thing coming within her to take over so she does that and fulfills it for the money and the fame. You feel what I'm saying? So, that's what they're doing. And we have one last video right here. This one, this one, I want to I wanna actually know what you guys think about this video right here. Because it's actually quite crazy. It could look, it could look very crazy. All right, so this is a TikTok video. This is, is it me or did Beyonce just turn into a demon mid-show? Let's get into this. Me or did Beyonce just turn into a demon mid-show? What do y'all think about that one, y'all? What do y'all think about this one? Because, like, right here, like, beforehand, like, her face looks bright. You feel what I'm saying? Like, it looks like her skin color. But then, like, mid, like, when she's shaking her head crazily, like, in the middle of it, like, she becomes more pale and her eyes become more black. What do y'all think? Yeah, 
What do y'all think about that one, yeah? For a fact, we already know that there's some there's some crazy stuff going on within this one right here, because this is not that's definitely not any normal behavior. Because she kept shaking her head even after Jay-Z left the scene. Jay-Z had to back up. Look, and she's like still shaking her head like to the ground. Like, you know what I'm saying? Something's very weird going on. And then also that they're best friends with a witch. And then her saying Sasha Fierce takes over. I feel like she's telling us everything that's really going on. Since you guys did watch this point of video, make sure you do like the video, subscribe if you are new, and turn on post notifications so you can catch me when I post again. I'm going to catch you guys in the next one the same way you're going to catch me in the next one. Peace.